Yeah. I'm legalized to I smoke. I don't smoke anymore. <laughs> so I'm not going to do this. I don't know if that's good See, if you flash it on camera, it's me. If I flash it on camera, it's my medication. Okay. It's two different things. You're a smart brother. We got to recap the Biggie movie. Yeah, that's what we could do. What's good with it? I really ain't like it. Okay, and now, now, that's I we need your we need your point on it now. Nah, I'm just saying, like you know, uh, the dialogue. I was around, like yeah, the dialogue was kind of corny. Was yeah, it was real weak. They had Kim looking corny. You know what I'm saying Kim is my girl. You know what I'm saying like I ain't like the way they. So have. you don't think they so, did so all right? So what's, what's the what's what's the issue with how Kim is portrayed? I think the girl did a good. You know I she mean, was cute. The, you gotta understand the actors played their parts. Gravy wait, wait, wait. played the shit out of Big, right. yeah, shout and out the to girl Gravy. played the shit out of Kim. You know that's but the chick that from 3 right? Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. That's she had, her? She had yeah, her teeth the, out crazy. The third, the one that got the shoved, got the other curved. two did the little right. cheating yeah. girls. That's her. She wow, had her little, her, little, her little titties popping on the screen early. Yeah, she was looking good. She, she gave is. a couple of back shots. I mean, I got enough of the titties on there, but it was it was good. It was I mean, look. I just felt like as far as Kim's character, it just made it seem like he just straight herbed her all the time. Like she wasn't doing her Yes thing. and no. Yeah. I think you know what I mean? She was every just angry and hating. Every time she called the phone, she was bothering him. Like. I, don't I mean, think she was had a like she was wife. a bugaboo. She had a you wife. gotta understand, no disrespect to Miss Miss Wallace. I love her and all that. I'm just saying, like that was her point of view. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. right. You know, and then she, and at least that don't mean that's the way it happened. That's right. the way she wanted right. to project it on. Towards screen. the end of the movie, he did give her that final call right before he went out. And, and that's like another thing. They made it seem right. like he tied up all his loose ends at the at end of the day, but it didn't really go down like that. Let's be real. Yeah, you could only do it so much in two hours. Right. Kim is really beef, but she said she wanted Christina really on the play. The girl was too black. She was too dark. That's a problem. Girl. That's crazy. Now, that's a problem. You know, so. Like, okay, so this is what it is. Let's go back She's to our other question. Now, let's go back to our other question. You remember I asked you if your man spit some bullshit, are you going to tell him? I want to know who the fuck are Kim's friends because ain't nobody telling her like, yo, Kim, Ma, you used to look this way and now you look this way. Like, stop fronting. Like, nobody stopped the girl. Nobody said, baby, I love you. You beautiful. Chill the fuck I out. I don't know, man. It's that guidance, man. You know, Maybe, you need to grab Jackson. Her Maybe you need to give her a good choke slam That's my right peoples. quick. I love Kim. Kim is the truth. You know what I mean? But she's, you know, Kim Love Kim. comes with the gritty, gritty she truth. She's got a mind of her own. I think it would have been real cute if they, you know, at one of the parties, you know, just for the hood, we could have had a, a young Nas or a young Jay or the Locks little thrown in there like they yeah, didn't they put didn't nobody it up. else yeah, in the right. movie you're right. I was waiting to see Jay or Nas Locks was around or the time. Nox yeah, Jay was, yeah, they was Jay the yeah. kid so th those was yeah. his people Charlie right. Baltimore you know what I mean it, it, it didn't Charlie end with nothing Baltimore. they could have even through the uh, you know we'll always love Big Papa at the end give some play to people that was oh, there shit. and, and show some you need respect to do a little more, it was kind of you know I was a little tight I was a little tight it was a lot of shit it was a lot of shit missing I definitely feel like they should have threw Charlie Baltimore in there a little bit you know, yeah, she should have got that bit. love because at the end of the day, what she said was like that car accident really did affect Big. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right. That was around the time they both was in the accident. It was they traumatic. didn't really touch on that shit. Right. You know All right, well, so what, what what you got to tell us? What's going I on? Mean, you know, I got the website popping, rugarell.com. Okay. You know Ruger what I'm saying? Rell. We got Ruger a lot Rell. of things going on up there. You know, the latest music. Ruga like all. the guns, Ruga. Yeah, Ruga like the guns, Ruga. P89, Ruga, you know. So you got a lot of new stuff out right yeah, now? Yeah, you know, I got the, the mixtape is you pretty much. You got something for Obama? That, the top get em boy right now, you got something? That's I the mean, top you know, that's, my, that's the big homie right now, okay. you know what I mean? Just you know, checking, you he, know, he making sure what everybody's do. doing. You know what I mean? It's time for a change. Hey, Obama, that thing. dude stunts I, I hope, like I hope a, you let him in. Habit. Yeah, he good. Uh, he so, so, yeah, being a, being a hard artist that you've been all this yeah. time, like, has it ever been put pressure on you, like, for you to try to change up what you did? Like, nah, nah. The because the cause people, cause you might affect somebody's kid in nah, Harlem or in the nah, Bronx. At the end of the day, it's, an, it's, it's a uh, parental advisory stick on every... And that should be it, right? Uh, that should be I it. agree. Because at the end of the day, you got porn, you got other things that kids... Oh, I just talk about that. The you internet is crazy now. You could just... Yeah, you gotta yeah. pay. Back in the days, we had to scrounge porn. around and get our pops our uncle's stash in the room. And reality kid, TV is yeah, a mess. A, a kid can go to the internet and, and pull Free up some type of all ill. Day. Yeah, like all so. black girls .com. Would you rather what he can Pink see or what he can hear? <laughs> you know what I mean? So, you know, like... like and I'm, even the little things like a double shot at love that you could catch on MTV. Now kids know what lesbians are. Shit is crazy. Easy. Yeah, like, what if you shit. never wanted your kid to see that? It's on primetime TV. I already know. Five o'clock in the afternoon. I already know. It's disgusting. Let's be. It's let's disgusting. Be but yeah, my lane, my lane is trying to get like closed in, like you know, like like gangster music. And at the end of the day, you know, I like you know, I, I don't mind staying independent. The money is good. Yep. You understand what I'm saying? You know, the are majors. You with, are you with Koch? Yeah, I got, I'm, I'm in six figures discussion with Koch right now for nice. my new deal. Nice. That's you know what I'm saying? It ain't it ain't it ain't it ain't etched in concrete yet, but we ain't we in discussion. You know I, I know back shout in the out, day. Shout out to Alan at Koch, you know what I mean? 
I know back in the day, a lot of artists used to make money off of doing shows. Is it still like it's that? It's still now? like that. Yeah, so you're doing how we, a lot of shows that's right That's how now? we survive. Like, nah, I'm not doing no shows right now. Okay. I'm just living out my bank account. I, was a, I wasn't a dumb nigga when that checks was coming. I saved my money. So what's up with the album? The album, working on that too. What's it called? You got a name? It's, uh, it's, in, it's, in, it's in the works. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I, it got to be people, something crazy. Some people like, nah, because like when you like when you put out an uh, album, it's like naming a kid. Right. You know, that's yeah. what I do, man. At the end of the day, DWI, like we've been here before. Yeah. Like, you know this is my lane, man. This yep. music thing is what I do. It's all yours, brother, so you can go in. Oh, Top Gunners is the new religion, by the way. Yeah, Dipset. Oh, oh, yeah. Mr. 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 Motherfucking Ruger. Yeah. Okay, Matrix Radio, y'all. Uh, oh, give me 20 Duchess. Smoke Trey Sour for an hour. Poppy about to put me in power with the powder. You see who your true friends when you get the new bands. Especially when you go take you to get new rims. Bring it through the block. Watch how they look at you. Judge wanna snatch you out of it and throw the book at you. Man, send some niggas at me. I send them back shot up. All of them are hefty duty garbage bags chopped up. You ain't seen war yet. Bring it to your doorstep. New M6. I ain't bulletproof the doors yet. It's for my career selling grams. And busting texts. Little niggas thinking they fly cause they busting checks. Fuck who co signed you or who you go signed to. All this shit is wrestling. I will clothesline you. Jump off the ropes and drop kick you. My whole arm look like one big popsicle. Ruga. Yeah. <laughs> I told you a long time ago. Wait a minute, man. I told you like four rhymes ago. I get busy. Niggas know me. I don't really sweat the drama. Stick your face in the tank. I got pet piranhas. You know what I do. You know how I do it. Fuck rap. You know what I sell. You know how I move it. And I heard the new Ferrari dropping. I might get it. Still in my style, I might switch it. Your bitch ain't doing no bit. She might visit, but she out here fucking a nigga who like tricking. And I ain't giving a shit, but I'm still boning her. She ain't accepting your calls, but you still calling her. <laughs> Taking shots at me, niggas be tripping. Down bottom half a bird or some Hillary Clinton. Caught him coming out his mama crib. Niggas be slipping. Made him run back in his mama crib and hide in the kitchen. Nigga, chill. Ruger, man. Extermination, man. Just set top gun. In the you know what it is. Yeah, we got the pretty D Malone in the hey, building. That rock and that purple polish. She got the wow, purple the pretty. She got the purple yes. shot. Right there, I was just going in. She came up to the Matrix doing it right. No, um, what what inspired you to get on that track, that Carrie Hilson? <laughs> um, actually, um, Drozilla actually hit me up and was like, Yo, D, we need to do, you know, a ill record right now. And I'm like, Okay, but which one? Right. And he was like, Yo. I'm gonna send you this joint. He's like, I think we should do the, the turning me on joint. And I was like, all right, let's do it. Yeah, well, it was Whatever cracking. Whatever you wanna do, let's it do it. Cracking. So he sent me the instrumental and I wrote it and that was that. That's, That's what's cool. up. So what city are you rapping for? Uh, I'm kinda doing two. I, I got Brooklyn and Queens. Uh, yeah, it's, you can't do. I, can't I, I, I was thinking you were saying like, come on, Brooklyn now. and I, I kinda, Miami, Brooklyn and Queens. Well, technically, I was kind of born and raised in Brooklyn. Okay. But I live now in Queens, so I guess you know what? I guess I gotta say farmers. I'm Queens. I'm okay, a Queens girl. Okay, now. okay. You're a Queens girl. Yeah, okay. I'm a Queens girl now. So I'm what brings you busy. all the way to the Bronx? Um, they asked me to come out and uh, talk about the <laughs> yes. the mixtape and Tell you know to introduce it. the actual remix that we just did. Can I see that? So we're looking at your CD cover right now, and you got a massive tech like going down the side of your whole like yeah everything's yeah. really big <laughs> yeah it yeah yeah that's that's, what's up. that's the I'll most recent one. most recent how many tests yeah. do you have I have col honestly fifteen right. <laughs> you gotta tell right. me what you want so, so what was some of your inspirations behind your tech um everything is is basically about me and music and how I love what I do. And you sing. And I sing. You rap? And I'm a songwriter. I don't rap. Okay. I tried maybe once or twice. Yeah. But, you know. Do you write your own music? <laughs> I write my own lyrics, yeah. That's what's up. How long have you been singing? Oh, God. Well, I started out singing when I was five, but I've been professionally singing for about maybe 11 years. Okay. Did you do the whole gospel choir thing? I did the whole gospel choir thing. I did the gospel choir at church. I did it at school. Right. I, you know, I, I stayed in one of those. Right, so. right. 